Yukon police Wednesday were still investigating a campus altercation that elevated into a national story when far-right commentator Lucian Wintrick was arrested Tuesday night after he delivered a speech titled, It is OK to be White. Quote, Conservative author and commentator Ann Coulter was among the first to voice her support for Wintrick who was charged with second-degree breach of peace after police say a woman removed documents from the lectern where Wintrick was speaking and he followed her into the audience and grabbed her, pulling her back in a violent manner, according to a report released Wednesday. Others on social media, such as Daily Wire editor Ben Shapiro, criticized Wintrick. The White House correspondent for pro-Trump website Gateway Pundit for his behavior which the police report said was tumultuous and caused significant disruption to the event. Quote, they added fuel to the sometimes hostile discourse that began with Wintrick's speech, where he said one side of America was run by illegal immigrant tranny communists, and said he couldn't tell if an audience member protesting him was a man or a woman, but that this is what we are battling against and it's sad to look at them. Quote, no one was injured in the altercation that ended the event and only Wintrick has been charged. Though Coulter said on Twitter she thought the woman who took the papers should be held responsible as well. The sheet of paper stolen from it Lucian Wintrick was obviously his speech, wrote Coulter. This is like calling a $100 bill a sheet of paper. She should be prosecuted. Quote, Campus police charged Wintrick. 29, with second-degree breach of peace and released him on $1. Oh, 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 bail. According to Yukon spokeswoman Stephanie Wrights, officers are continuing their investigation and reviewing videos of the altercation to determine whether anyone else's behavior warrants charges, Wrights said. Wrights declined to name the woman and said it's unknown if she is connected to the university. After Wintrick was released, he took to Twitter to defend his actions, posted his full speech and slideshow on Gateway Pundit and said he would be pressing charges against the woman who took his speech in the university that failed to secure my freedom of speech and safety. Quote, Another contributor to the website wrote about the incident and noted that Wintrick had been drinking from a glass of milk during the event to trigger the leftists. Quote, Milk has been used as a symbol of, of white supremacy by some members of the alt-right, purportedly because more white people can digest milk than other populations. In a live TV interview Wednesday afternoon at Bradley International Airport, Wintrick said he was perplexed how people could condemn his actions or defend the woman's, who he called a college advisor. It doesn't matter if it's a speech or a stock bond from 1910. It was my property that this college advisor was able to steal from the lectern.